What up guys, this is Kong, and today I'm going to be doing another movie review for you guys. Today I'm going to be talking about Digimon Adventure Try uh, Loss. Uh, the reason I want to watch this movie because I'm a huge fan of animation, um, anime, um, uh, especially anime, uh, Japanese anime, and I love cartoons in general. So I'm going to talk about the pros and the cons. This is going to be short because it's... You know, it's not much to talk about this movie. So what did I like about this pro uh, the, the movie is that the voice actor and actress are great for, you know, this move this kind of movie. The voice for the Digimon are are cute, lovable. You can tell that there are it's just they're great act great voice actors and actress. Uh the animation are clean and fluid. Uh it's really a nostalgia for me because I used to watch Digimon as a kid. So this to me is like it was a nostalgia trip for me. Uh, it made me feel like I was a kid again, and I really liked that uh, aspect of it. And I appreciated that. And like you know what, I got to feel like a kid again. I enjoyed it. Uh, now let's talk about the con. The con is that it's short. There's no real depth for the characters or the uh, the Digimon or the the villain. For all that matters, uh, the cliffhanger is sudden and annoying. It's brief. It wasn't. They didn't really prepare you for it. It's just like here it is. It's done. And when I, when I was watching it, I'm like, the movie is done. You know, I thought it was gonna be more of uh, a little bit better, but it was it was done. And I'm like, oh, okay. I didn't really expect that, so I was like, all right, whatever. It's, you know, it's the Digimon is an anime uh, show, uh, so that's to be expected. So, so what kind of score I would give this to be? I would actually, the more I think about it, I want to give this a score a rating of 5 out of 10 because the movie is short. It feels short. No character, no depth, uh, no development. And it's just really just a uh, a movie for people who love cartoons and animes and stuff like that. So I give it a five. Um, I would say you know you can go if you have the time, but it's not one of those movie where you have to go watch it. It's not one of those anime movies. You're like oh yes, you have to watch it. It's one of those things. But it, this this movie is not. It's one of those movies where you could probably watch it online, watch it on the red box, or watch it when you're bored with your kids, that sort of thing. So I give it a score of 5 out of 10. So again guys, please like, thumbs up, share, subscribe, and browse my channel guys. There's a lot of content on there for you to check out. Please do so. I appreciate it. And most importantly, um, I want to thank you so much for your time and effort to watching my movie review. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.